Kanye West's attacks on Pete Davidson continue. On Wednesday, the Donda 2 musician, 44, released an alarming video for his song Easy, featuring fellow rapper The Game. In the footage shared on West's Instagram page, a claymation version of Pete Davidson, 28, is kidnapped, tied up, and buried alive. After growing roses around the comedian, 28, West is then seen standing on top of a garden as the lyrics, God save me from that crash, just so I could beat Pete Davidson's ass are heard. Toward the end of the video, a truck full of roses, similar to the one he appeared to deliver to estranged wife Kim Kardashian on Valentine's Day, pans across the view. West then references Skeet, a nickname Hess called Davidson several times in now-deleted social media posts, as the words, everyone lived happily ever after slash except Skeet you know who slash JK Hess fine, appear on the screen. Many fans have since called out West for the video on Twitter. That Kanye video is actually disturbing, Pete needs to sue and file a restraining order, one user wrote, with another adding, I love Kanye but this Betty S, is embarrassing and everyone praising him for it clearly don't give a f, about him. Like if something happens to Pete, Kanye will truly be f, Ed cause has leaving all the evidence online. One user labeled the video emotional abuse, stating that it will end very badly for this family. They continued, I felt terrified, can't imagine how Kim feels. Has terrorizing her as punishment and I hope people will stop excusing this as art. A fan also questioned, are we going to let Kanye continue publicly bullying Pete Davidson? As another noted Kanye has hit a very scary point. If I was Kim or Pete, it'd be down at the police station filing a restraining order yesterday. This isn't the first time West has shared concerning images about Davidson, who has been linked to Kardashian since October. The Skims founder filed for divorce from West in February 2021 and was declared legally single Tuesday, just before West released the video. As Kardashian's romance with Davidson flourished before the public A, the Yeezy designer launched several attacks on social media and in the press. He shared screenshots of texts had received from both Kardashian and Davidson, along with memes that he captioned with harassing messages. Earlier this month he said he was taking accountability for the posts. In a picture of him standing solo on a platform surrounded by clouds, and said he was working on his communication skills. I've learned that using all caps makes people feel like I'm screaming at them. I'm working on my communication, he wrote. I can benefit from a team of creative professionals, organizers, mobilizers and community leaders. Thank everybody for supporting me. I know sharing screenshots was jarring and came off as harassing Kim, he continued. I take accountability. I'm still learning in real time. I don't have all the answers. To be, a, good leader is to be a good listener. However, West has continued sharing posts about Davidson, Kardashian and her family in the weeks since. If you're experiencing domestic violence, call the National Domestic Violence Hotline at 1-800-799-7233, or go to thehotline.org. All calls are toll-free and confidential. The hotline is available 24-7 in more than 170 languages.